friend. I'm practicing that for Red. Faso, tonight is the last night of Ramadan. That one month is called the, the night of power. And Faso is my good Muslim friend. I was going to make, you know, like a joke about that, but that was only if Faso didn't show up. You know, so now that he's here, i got to change my, my routine because I don't want to be insensitive. You know, I'm a Jewish guy. That makes it even more, more uh, you know, awkward because of the, you know, Israeli-Palestinian uh, conflict in the Mideast. But what about that terror warning tonight? Because tonight they closed all those embassies up and everybody's on a high alert. So I was, you know, s smoking some pot earlier. You probably can't tell, you know, because I misunderstood when they said high alert. I thought it was like a, like a, a green light to, you know, get involved in all that illegal criminal activity. And, but I've actually, I don't know if you've noticed or not, but I've, I've actually lost some weight. And, uh, of course, my lady friend, she's, you know, she just, she enjoys this extra energy, this, this uh, you know, um, you know, you know, she likes to just like, you know, really, uh, you know, get it on with all my, my guts and everything. She's trying to give me a heart attack or something, but... Uh, Anyway, um, I don't really have that much to say. I wanted to, thank you. I wanted to be funny tonight. Um, I wanted to, um, all right, there we go. We've got some new people here. So, uh, yeah, yeah, you know, we had a good meal at uh, Ruby Tuesdays. But you got to order it without the, uh, what is that called? Without the, um, where it gets too spicy. Pepper, yeah. No pepper, otherwise you can't eat that stuff. And then of course the salad bar is great. You know, what I like to do is right before I finish the meal, I go up and I just put a mountain of my salad bar in there, and then I ask, you know, if I could take it home, and I get some dirty looks, you know, but, um, and I'm really a good tipper. I mean, I usually, um, you know, I mean, if, if, the, if the item is like, if I'm there for, uh, if the whole thing costs like three or four dollars, I'll actually give a dollar tip. That's like a, what, 80% tip? Very generous tipper, very generous tipper. And, uh, you know, I should only give them like 50 cents or 20 cents because, I mean, anything more than 20 or 30% is outrageous. But, so I'm very popular. You know, people just love me when they, when, oh, there's that guy again, you know, great tipper, you know. And uh, let's see what else. <laughs> when you when you start saying that what else, you know you're you're in big trouble, <laughs> big big trouble. Let's see. Um, uh, the weekend went pretty fast, right? Pretty fast, and uh, I can't believe we're already in August. It's just really unbelievable. Uh, let's see. How much more time do I have? Three minutes. <laughs> Three more minutes? Oh my God, I just started. I'm asking how much more time. Pathetic. But, oh, I remember um, this past um, Sunday, a week ago, I'm sure you all missed uh, Robin and I, and you were probably wondering, oh, where's Robin and Ken? Because, you know, we're so popular among the, the comedy uh, world. Of course, we were um, at the improv cheering our friend Faso and Isabel. And they came up with totally new material. We couldn't believe it. You know, total... You know, you know how some, you know, comics or comedians, they, they, I think they, they can call them comics, right? They're comedians, it's always interesting. They use both words, depending on if you're in the 70s or the 2014, 13s or something. And um, some of the comics use the same material and they enhance it, you know, and they get better and better, but they, they narrow it down into the same kind of stuff. And some of the, 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 the experts of comedy, you know, encourage that. And then the other style is you do totally new stuff. So it's kind of interesting to see which, you know, depending on your, you know, personality. I guess there's no right or wrong, you know, answer. So I like to just come up here and just do things off the cuff, you know, fast. So he suggests I write things down, you know, I mean... Um, you know, I mean, because, you know, I've got a very short-term memory and I forget things. So, um, you know, one of these days I'm going to actually, you know, uh, take him up on that advice. Just sit down and, 
you know, actually write things down. It's amazing how some people like myself, you know, we keep everything in our head. You know, and it's really a huge mistake. You know, some people, they just don't, they don't like to write things down. And, it's, and yet the irony is when I was a kid growing up, I actually had a diary. When I was like five or six years old, this is a true story, I just realized it at this second, I actually wrote everything down about my first girlfriend. And, oh, that means I've got one more minute? One more minute, okay, great. So I got one more minute, this is great. We got a nice little crowd. The weather is, is the weather getting worse or better? Both. And both. <laughs> so uh, yeah, you know, it's good to be here. This is my, I think, fifth time. I don't, thank you. Yeah. I don't really plan on making a um, career out of comedy. I just, I just spend enormous amounts of time watching TV and I, I think I'm getting um, brain damaged. I have to talk to my psychiatrist about that and maybe they can shrink my brain and, and make, make me a better person. Anyway, that's, I'm almost done, right? Thank you. Thank you.